The repair shop presenter Jay Blades has pleaded not guilty to charges of controlling and coercive behaviour against his estranged wife. The BBC restorer appeared in Worcester Crown Court today, October 11. The charge relates to his wife Lisa Zabozan, a fitness instructor, the court heard. Ms Zabozan announced that the pair's relationship was over in an Instagram post on May 2. The 54-year-old appeared at Kidderminster Magistrates Court on September 13 in relation to the same charge and was bailed until his next court appearance. Mr. Blades appeared in court on Friday charged with engaging in controlling or coercive behavior towards his wife. The repair shop star is accused of causing 43-year-old M. Zabozan to fear violence would be used against her on at least two occasions. Mr. Blades, from Claverley in Shropshire, appeared before the recorder of Worcester, Judge James Burbage KC on Friday. The charge sheet states he allegedly engaged in behavior towards Lisa Marie Zabozan that was controlling or coercive which had a serious effect on her, namely that it caused her to fear, on at least two occasions, that violence will be used against her, at a time when he knew or ought to have known that the behavior will have a serious effect. The offenses took place between January 1, 2023, and September 12, 2024, it is alleged. The charge against Jay Blades alleges that his behavior had a serious effect on his partner namely that it caused her to fear on at least two occasions that violence would be used against her. Judge James Burbage KC rejected an application for part of the proceedings to be heard in private. Adjourning the case with a possible trial date of May 6 next year, the judge removed a bail condition that Blades should be subject to an electronic tag, which had not yet been fitted due to failings by the company responsible. The judge told Blades, you have denied responsibility for the crime alleged against you and the prosecution proposed to try you. I remove the tagging of your exclusion zone but you are still subject to the exclusion zone.